I would like to take you on a journey. A journey which perhaps you may not be ready to take, but one that nonetheless we will all eventually experience. So don't think about this reminder as simply fun and entertainment, but instead think about this as a sneak preview of the main show to come. You will be the focus of our attention. This is your story from the end to the end. And it all begins with the scary and daunting realization that you're dying. And you don't even know it. Never saw it coming. But you were so young, so much life, so much loving, so much hope, so much sorrow. I guess so much for tomorrow. Your family will miss you dearly. Still can't believe that you're gone. The news hasn't sunk in. They still think you're coming home. When things don't go our way, the entire world must be wrong. They say it wasn't your time, but to Allah we belong. Your soul left your body before you had the chance to say goodbye. It caught you unexpected within the blink of an eye. You were busy with the world when you felt a tingle in your spine. Your heart began to race, your eyes became blind. Coming closer to the light, was this a trick from your mind? Or did you really just cross this life's finish line? The cost of deception is that everyone's gotta die In a world where everybody is just trying to stay alive Even if you aren't ready, it could come at any time Doesn't ask for your permission, doesn't need you to co-sign The dirt is getting ready and your hole has been assigned Your mother helps to wash your body one last time Pray, Georgia Naza, it was raining cats and dogs. They put you in the ground, and now you're all alone. Hearing footsteps of your friends as they begin to moan. We wish you all the best, so sad you had to go. People talk about death, but what about when death talks to you? Rips the soul from your body, will you finally say it's true? The good may die young, but the bad still gotta die too. Every soul shall taste a sip from this restless brew. This is the day you were promised your grand debut. No turning back now, no makeups, no redos from this point on there is no need to review it's just do or die or in your case just do it's all you the real absolute moment of truth and just like that perfectly on cue two angels enter your grave sit you up and ask you who is your lord <laughs> الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ألهاكم التكاثر حتى زرتم المقابر كلا سوف تعلمون ثم سوف تعلمون كلا لو تعلمون علم اليقين لترون الجنة
الجحيم ثم لترونها عين اليقين ثم لتسألون In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. The mutual rivalry for piling up worldly things divert you until you visit your graves. No, you shall come to know. Again, no, but you shall come to know. No, if you only knew with certain knowledge, surely you shall see the blazing fire. And again, you shall see it with the certainty of sight. Then on that day, you shall be asked about the delights you indulged in. When the angel of death comes to visit, there will be no discussion or room for negotiations. You cannot ask for an extension upon this earth. You've had your chance, and so it is now time to return back to your Lord. At the graveyard, all your friends and family surround you in tears. It's hard to say goodbye, but they don't have a choice. They place you in the ground, say their final words, and the moment the last one of them leaves, your real test begins. Out of nowhere, two black and blue angels enter inside of your grave, sit you up and ask you the most challenging three questions you have ever heard in your life. Who is your Lord? What is your religion? And who is your prophet? You may think you know the answer today, but for some people, they will become baffled, replying, Um, um, I, I don't know. But after this interrogation, they would have solidified the results of their exam, and thus will remain in a place called Al-Barzakh, a world between two worlds, either receiving their punishment or gaining their reward for as long as Allah wills, until eventually all creation will come to an end at the sound of the horn.